love with your eyes. I didn't fell in love, love. I didn't fell in love with your eyes. I didn't fell in love with your eyes. What's up, you guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Key Ever Chanel. Why I go by Keeks? Keeks on the B, Keeks with the cheeks. Kiwi, whichever one is fine with me. Today, I'm doing another half of half down install as if I didn't do it like 30,000 times on my channel. It's kind of one of my favorite hairstyles, especially when I'm dealing with like curly textures and stuff like that. Today's hair is sponsored by BGM Girl Hair. They sent me a Water Wave 22 inch unit, 13 by 6 HD lace. It was a whole deal. But stay tuned for the confessional because I got a lot to say about this wig. So we're going to get into the video. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, welcome to From Keeks Confessionals, where I give you guys the raw uncut opinion about the hair that I review. So, this hair is from BGM Girl Hair. And to be honest, I don't even think this company is ran by black people. I don't even know if it stands for Black Girl Magic, but that's what it's given. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this one. This is their 22 inch water wave. In all actuality, it's a tight curl. It's a fairly tight curl. Let me just go ahead and tell y'all what I do not like about this hair. And that's the fact that it fucking stinks. Like, it didn't make me a headache, bro. Like, it, it just stinks. It's so loud. It smells like fish, literally. It smells like fish. I don't know what be going on in these factories. I don't know what be going on. But my hair should not be coming to me smelling like feet and fish. Like, the one thing I just be thinking about is, let's say I want to go meet a nigga or something. And I'm hugging up on him. I'm cutting him all up on him. The last thing I need is for a nigga to think I'm unsanitary. And I'm a dirty little girl because my hair smells like fucking fish. Like, do you understand how embarrassing that is to try to explain that to a nigga? Oh, yeah, it's not me. Is my hair like please stop i washed this hair like three times i washed it with my shampoo and my shampoo smell good as fuck but the fact that i can still smell that little lingering factory smell that type of stuff made me not even want to wear the hair no more so like it's just like y'all gotta get this together i don't know what be going on but y'all just need to fix it that was like one of my biggest pet peeves with this unit. Another thing is that the knots were like stubborn as hell. And it's giving real orangey, brassy tones. Even after I went in on my purple strong shampoo to tone it, it was, mm, the knots was weak as hell. Before I even got to plucking, I had already had a bald spot. That's really why I went in and did the little ventilating stuff. It's a lace fronted. They give us like two inches apart. That, that's another thing. Stop doing that, bro. Stop. Why would I buy a 13 by 6 frontal and I'm only able to do 13 by 6 down the middle? Like, make it make sense. If we really sit here and thinking about it, they is cheating and fucking, they all trying us an arm and a leg for a frontal piece and it's not even a whole frontal. Like, running my coins back. Let's say I want to do some braids to the back, you know, in the front. I can't even do that with this wig because why? I only got two inches of parting space right there. And I didn't even pluck the rest of it out. Like, these companies need to get to you. But nonetheless, it was a cute little wig. I'm gonna keep y'all updated on the performance and how it holds up via my Instagram, via the comment section, all of that good stuff. So make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Make sure you are following me on Instagram, Kira Chanel underscore. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Turn on your post notifications so that you're aware of when I post. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!